Wow, this isn't good, is it, people? Hello guys, it's me, Bad Jokes, back at you once again with another video. And today, guys, we've got episode number five of my Met Police save. And yeah, not looking good, is it, people? So, since you were last with me, we've played the one game. We lost that one, 3-2. Let me just show you who that was against and what happened in the game. It was against Walton Casuals. And, yeah, you can see there, 3-2, Brandon Scott with a double for Walton, and Jaden Antwi with their, with their other goal. Tom the Armour got us one, Blackmore got us the other, but then Jerry Amu sending off really did kill the game off for us. And so, I was playing this, obviously, after the last episode. Uh, I thought, you know what, I'll get a few games in, maybe get through to January, and so then we can get on to the next episode. But then immediately after that game, it's still the same day in game, I get given this message. So I've not played this for a couple of days, been waiting to record so I can do this meeting with you guys on video. So let's all be brave, pray for bad jokes, pray for bad jokes. You know what, let me know down below in the comments what you think they're going to say. I think they're going to give us a points target, I'm going to say... 10 points from next five games that's what i'm gonna say they're gonna want so let's go attend the meeting let me know what you think they're gonna say let's go attend meeting we are not happy with your current performance and are considering your position at the club we'd like to know why you think the team have performed so badly ah uh, first job in management do you think i go for that um, we hope you can learn from your mistakes. Being new to position is no justification to give you any favours. Oh, okay. Tell me what I need to do to save my job. I think that's what I'm going to say. It's either that or the last thing the club needs is more upheaval. But I don't think I've got a leg to stand on to say the upheaval one. Okay, tell me what I need to do. We'll give you some more time. We expect you to pick up 12 points in the next five games. I was close. I'm going to try and be cheeky and ask for a little bit lower. See what they say. We feel the points target is acceptable. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. I'm, I'm going to have to accept it and get on with it. Craig Rose, thank you very much for that. And so... 12 points from the next five games. I'm going to bring you the first game today against Harrow Borough. Where are they in the league? They're sixth in the league. Oh, no, no, no. A tactical rethink is needed. I'll be back with you guys just before the Harrow Borough game with that new tactic. Hello, guys. We're back. It's time for the game away to Harrow Borough. Our first game in the set of five where we have to get 12 points, which Mathematical Genius has just worked out, means I've got to win four of them. I need to win four of my next five games. Oh, and I've just been shouting to myself for the last five minutes. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. So, I've not changed much. So much for a tactical overhaul. This is what I'm going for right now. Only things I've really changed is Brown and Myers are now fullbacks on defend rather than wing backs. And Niyama is now a deep line playmaker. And Gokken Gottman has come in for the suspended Jerry Amu, who got sent off in that game that I played off camera. And so, no time like the present, eh? Let's go. Alright, and here we are. We're here at the game. Harrow are going for a more uh, traditional 4-4-2. They have got... I can't read these names. They have got Walton in goal. Davis Coker on the left. Parr on the right. Ricketts and Soldy in the centre of defence. Barr on the right-hand side. Cribbley on the left. Brown and McLeod in the middle of the park. Coker and Delhi are... Oh, that Dell? Yes, yeah, Dell up top. So that's them. Let's go. Come on, lads. 
five games to save my job. If we can get a win here today, I'll be feeling a lot, lot better. The media have been on your backs lately. Only one person's relaxed. Two. Come on, I want some more green. Nope. I certainly think there's a lot more to come from you. And that's Blackmore who's got some more confidence. So let's go kick off the game. As here we are, the players are just walking out onto the pitch. And now it's them with the ball. Ricketts with a long ball forward early doors. And we clear that one away. Here we go, 35 minutes in. First proper highlight of the game. And it's us getting the ball into the box. But Brown with an awful cross goes straight to their keeper. And now what is he going to do? He kicks it long. Can we win it back? We do. Gherkin Gottman with it. To Niyama. With a nice pass there. Blackmore's in the box. Can he cross it? He does. Oh, it's off the post. Oh. Thought that was the one to give us the lead. But we've got a corner. The highlight continues. Edmonds with it. He whips it in. And it's a header there. But that's saved easily by the Harrow keeper. Here we go. One last highlight before the half. We get it forward. Blackmore, can he get it wide? He does. And can Edmonds keep this in? Again, he does. He crosses it in. It's there for the header. Yes! Charlie Collins with his sixth goal of the season. Gets us a vital goal before half time. Blackmore with it. What a nice pass that was to Edmonds. And Edmonds with a beautiful cross. And Collins with the header. The keeper, I think, got a hand to it. But he could not keep it out. Alright guys, so that is half time. They've had six shots to our five. Three on target to our four. And possession has been very, very even. But we are the team that are ahead. So let's go into the dressing room. And I'm going to go, we've got a guard against complacency. Because I need this result. And everyone, well most of them are focused. So let's go into the second half. 65 minutes gone. First highlight of the second half. But it's us again winning the ball back. Gottman with a long ball there. Blackman just sort of gave up on that one. Sort of pulled up. I think, I think if he had carried on running for it, he would have got onto that. But whatever. Their keeper kicks the ball long. And again, we win it back. Edmonds with another ball over the top, but unable to get through to our striker. And now, oh, our defender, our defence has gone to sleep there. Coolcott with a cross, but Arthur gets it to Williams. To Quibley. Can we win it back, please? That's a ball into the box. That's a head on. That's a goal. No, 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 no. Coolcott with his second of the season. And it's another headed goal in this game. We just we just went to sleep when the initial initial attack came in. And then Coolcott with a header. Williams a little bit unlucky to not keep that one out. All right, guys. About 20 minutes left. I've just made a couple of changes. Harry Stanley coming on for Luke Robertson and Trey Williams coming on for Max Blackmore and going into the poach, poacher role. Let's really hope this can get us the win we need. Four minutes left of normal time. I've just gone very attacking. Williams loses the ball there, but Niyama wins it back, but he gives it away. Oh, no. No, no. Oh, this might have been a mistake going very attacking. This might have been a mistake. Bar with the ball. Please don't be a bar humbug. He crosses it in. It goes to Williams. This highlight is not over yet. Williams kicks the ball long. And Williams nods it down but again gives it away. And we get it back somehow. Brown back to the keeper. He rifles at him. But then Williams kicks it long. And no, we don't win it back. It's a bit back and forward here. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. Oh. I don't know any words. I don't have any words anymore. One last free kick. And oh, saved by the keeper off the line. Uh, Billy Brown gets the ball forward. I shouldn't have gone attacking. Billy Brown kicks it long and oh, referee's surely going to be blowing his whistle sometime soon. As now Corkett's coming forward. Oh no, come on. 3 1 would be harsh. The referee saves us from that. 
Oh, what a roller coaster of emotions that game was. Oh, that leaves us with four games left, needing to win them all to stay in a job. Oh, my gosh. Well, if you just go into the team talk, they had 13 shots to our 11, 7 on target to our 6. So we was a little bit unlucky. I think a draw would have been the better result. Uh, calm, can't fault you for your effort. And everyone's delighted. Let's hope that that will help us out in the next game, which is going to be in the next episode against Farnborough, who again are quite high up in the league. It's not going to get any easier. And so that is where I'm going to leave it for today, lads. If you've enjoyed the video, pop a massive thumbs up down below. Subscribe to the channel for more FM content. I am Bad Jokes Gaming. Follow me on Twitter at Bad Jokes Gaming. And yeah, one thing left to say. Pray for me, please. Pray for me, please.